We have been here all evening long and we have seen a steady stream of travelers arriving here at LaGuardia. We spoke to many of them and those we spoke with, they use one word. They had one word in common and that is normal. That flying this Memorial Day weekend made it feel like life was getting back to normal. By road, rail, or air, Americans are on the move this Memorial Day weekend. Many wanting to break free from COVID confinement. The Demircos took a family trip. It was really busy. Yeah, I was surprised. Meaning security-wise or the plane? Like what was? Oh, busy? like the plane was busy, but everybody had a mask on, and yeah, it was pretty safe. AAA predicted 37 million people plan to travel 50 miles or more this weekend. That's up 60 percent from last year. Airports are particularly busy. Last Memorial Day, travel was at an all-time low with only about 1.5 million people. This year, TSA screened 5.2 million travelers from Friday through Sunday alone. I think people are just chomping at the bit. They're really eager to get out. You know, AAA is a very large leisure travel agency and we have seen bookings just through the roof of rental cars and hotels traveling it feels back to normal honestly airports are really busy flight was packed the surge in travel comes as COVID cases reached its lowest number in more than a year according to johns hopkins just over 7,000 new cases monday that's a far cry from the days the u.s saw over 100,000 new daily cases this is my first plane ride yeah so since the start of everything Great to finally see some people and like start to get back to normalcy again. Vaccinations are also on the rise. More than 50% of eligible Americans have received at least one shot. For many travelers we spoke with, that's the peace of mind they needed. The airports were busy. Um, I went to Miami. Um, you know, down in Florida, it was a little not not really people wearing their masks there, but that's fine. I'm vaccinated, so I'm fine with it. And while COVID restrictions have loosened all across the country, masks are still required on planes and in all airports. Now, air travel is also expected to soar this summer. A clear sign of that, the TSA is adding 6,000 additional officers. We're live tonight outside LaGuardia. I'm Shirley Chan, PIX11 News.